Hello all and welcome back to Lords of the Fallen. Walk through part 17. Let's uh we're we're here at the crow's nest. This is the nest for the vestige. Our buddy's here. He's moved now from base to here. He's got his little bag of tricks up here hanging. I don't know how he got up there. Maybe he can jump, I don't know. I was aware but go ahead and talk to him. And go through his uh I've been hearing dialogue until he becomes a, bird, a merchant like again. That pain. Well, hello again. And uh, buy anything you might need from him. We're going to throw on some... I mean, you might already have some, but if you don't, you grab some of this. Or some of this. This is a cure. This is some resistance. So this lasts a little bit longer. Uh, we should have them already, hey, but so blessed. let's check and see. I already threw some on, so yeah, I'm going to throw that on. Shouldn't need much of that. Uh, we got a boss fight coming up, but we got to die because we need Kukujin to, uh, you know, push her side quest along. So run in. This is the crow. There's a, a little, you know, I don't know, witch, I guess. Chick rolling around over here doing her thing. Um... But yeah, I mean, for now, we just need to die anyway. <clears throat> you do not need to be an umbral for this fight. There's an easier way to deal with her. You are going to be snatching her up um, at the right times. It's going to be... It should be like six... Soul flares. She's gonna grab her, pull her out, do some damage, and uh, but I'll walk through everything as I'm as I'm fighting the fight. We'll talk through it. Just kind of want to get the the ball rolling here because there's a lot to do on part 17. All of these parts are full, man. Because you have your you know you have your like normal realm and you have your umbral realm and you know. Uh, if you haven't got an Umbral Execution yet, we're going to try to pull that off. Here she is. Say yes to her. I think she's 6,000 Vigor for this one. But yeah, uh, buff up. Do not enter Umbral. You don't need that. Come on in here. Let's fight the crow. Excuse me. be skipping that. So she's gonna pop out. There's there's AOE. A lot of AOE stuff here. There's a lot of little enemy enemies. Those change. Witches will be round two. Uh, and then... So pop her out. You should be able to get her health down about halfway each time you do that. So that's one. She'll roll back through. You can help with enemies. Keep Kukujin alive if you want. I need some stamina. Uh, they'll do his, the crow does this storm. You do not want to be on the outside. You want to be on the inside. She should be back now. Back up a little bit from that AOE that she does when she pops in. And she go. There she is. Slow flare her again. Should be able to take her out. Now this is the execution, the umbral execution right there. I don't like the way that it did that, but we'll do it again. Heal up. Once she's been taken down, come back here. The crow's gonna do his thing now. He's gonna throw uh, icicles all over the floor, and then he's gonna throw them at you in a row. Like that. See that row coming at us? And then he's gonna like do spikes like that. But if you're back here, you can usually avoid most of this stuff pretty easily. If you need to, go ahead and pop a resistance. Oh nice, he got me as we're popping it. But yeah, I mean, if you're up here, he throws the spikes, you back up to the wall, no big deal. Just watch out for the stuff that's rolling around. Now on this phase, we're going to have the witches pop up with the enemy. There she comes, there's like an AoE from that. I'll be in that. And the witches. The witches spawn in all of their friends as well, making it even more fun. Wow, well, I don't... Really wish that would show up so you guys could see the beam. It's so cool. 
it's not just this character. I had another character that I was uh, doing some stuff with, and I was trying to beam out there as well. Should be another witch. Um, oh, no, we're good. So let's go get her. Same thing. Rinse and repeat. Soul Flare. Try to get her down to half. Buff up. Clear enemies in the meantime. And I'm gonna die. All right, let's pop her again. Same thing. There we go. <clears throat> Umbral execution. She gets something for that. Now on this round of this fight, it's gonna be the uh, guardians. So back up to the back here. Crow gets a little more aggressive on each round with his attacks. Here he goes. Just roll through that stuff. Ugh, come on. Usually you can avoid all that, no problem. You can see it's a little more aggressive now. It's not a hard fight. Is you know if you know how things work, he's gonna do the big like storm around the arena, AOE type deal. Should be done. She's gonna come back. I'm gonna concentrate on the first guardian that spawns in, and then her. There he is in the middle. Back up from him. He wants to be difficult, I guess. Okay, fine. Come on, dude. Usually that's not that big of a deal. I wasn't standing in the right place. Apologize for that. I want to torch him, though. There we go. All right, go pull her. Two more times and it should be it with her. Then the crow will fall down. Oh yeah, we got her. Just gonna pop and heal. Oh, storm, get inside the storm. It's gonna be much uh, smaller of a window for us there. If you go Umbral here, you know, so be it. See if I can pop her. Get this done. Got the crit, got the crit. And done. Gotta wipe everything out. Crow will do his thing. Fall down, bring his head down to you. And then that gives you a chance to, to bonk him in the head and uh, end the fight. It could go smoother than that, but it's okay. It wasn't, uh, I think with like trying to explain everything at the same time of doing stuff, sometimes it's not as, it's not as clean. Bonk him. <clears throat> Take the crow out. And that's over. You're going to enter Umbral here if you're not already in Umbral. Grab the stigma. Run ahead here for some loot. Exit Umbral. And this stigma should finish. Done. Down we go. Out and around and we're gonna take this path. If you remember the three big heads, that is all down there. Wow, there's loot down there. Oh well. And then this is where the three big heads fight all happened. Down there underneath us. Ahead of us is another beacon. Push into the beacon, climb a ladder, go up to the beacon. I'm doing nothing with the beacons. If you've already lit a beacon, continue to light the beacons. If you lit one on accident, continue to light them because you're going to be doing the good ending. 
if you're doing nothing and you want to do the Inferno ending, then uh, Demaros is is your is your person. Lots of loot, lots of candy in here uh, for upgrades. Do nothing. So we got everything from here. Roll back down. Roller, climb up to you. Out here. Man, look at that 23,000 vigor. Makes me want to go back to the vestige and upgrade because we have to go out and die. In this arena in front of us, there's going to be two pieces of loot. The Light Reaper is going to come, but this isn't the time that we fight him. So go ahead, grab this loot, enter Umbral. And let him kill you. Alright, back to the crow, or to the nest, run through all of this, go back to the beacon, back to where the light reaper was, pick up our vigor, let's go down the ladder, um, out and around, down the ladder to the left, when we enter the door over here to the beacon tower, out to where the light reaper was, Grab our vigor. Grab the last, or grab that piece of loot that was kind of underneath that archway. You can't get that during the the light reaper fight. It closes the arena with like the moss, so you can't you can't grab that. And we'll do the next part. Grab that. A lot of stigmas in this in this uh, part 17. Gonna have another stigma ahead of us here. Rolled off. Enter Umbral. Around the stigma. Oh, not that, buddy. Where we are right now, this is back to the beginning. Kind of where we first entered into this world, this, this zone. And this over here takes you to a drop off. Um, the drop off where we fought the big head and got the uh, catalyst that we didn't need. So roll back down here. Up here there's going to be uh, a gargoyle. Can't melt him from that range. Okay, what's up with that? There we go. Absolutely can melt him from here. Take him out. There's going to be another belly to pop here. For loot. Lots of stuff... Lots of bellies to pop too. Oh, another one, where is he? I, I missed him. Nah, don't worry about him. Push ahead. <clears throat> you gotta pop this door open. It's weird they have this open room and no loot. I'm gonna stay right here. Gonna pop this door lock. That's for the door right in front of us here. Gonna head this way. There's gonna be a couple more gargoyles over here and some loot. Come on, get it. Got him. Where's the other one? Oh. There's two there. Grab this loot. There was another piece of loot there. Over across here, pop this. We gotta open this up to, uh, to gain access to the other lock. There's gonna be a fairy in here and some loot. Roll out, roll out.
take her out. Okay, let me through. She usually drops loot as well. Grab this over here. Don't worry about Umbral, we should be done with this soon. There's gonna be a big head past the door with a lock. Prepare for that. If you need to pop and get some more mana while it's regening, that's what I normally do. Because we have the regen, but I always pop this as well and just to give me what I need. So go ahead and get the uh, big head. After you pop this door, get him activated, bring him to the door, take him out. And right, so this guy. the door come on door Is that even possible? Give me this guy trying to fight. Didn't work. Oh, come on with this door. <laughs> All right, cool. Done. Vigor. I lost all of it. Oh man, that was important. Oh well. Grab this uh, loot over here. Clear the room. Man, I lost all of that. Yeah, it happens. Go into your inventory. Pop them off. It's all good. I'll go get it back. I'll farm it. No big, no big deal. All right. Go through the um door, pop door, fairy loot, uh, big head, pop loot, and upgrade. Oh yeah, pop loot, that for the upgrade. And Okay, now we're back here. Now we're gonna go to base and we're gonna wrap up a couple of things. All right. Actually, we don't even have the money to pay her. This is troubling. Mm. This messed things up for me. My bad. Don't do that. Uh, we can sell some stuff. Gotta pay. Kuka Jen, I think she's like six grand too. Um, I'd rather use these for upgrades, but so some I think that'll cover her expenses. Got a pair. A pleasure. The wise always. And go across over here. Talk to Andreas. You if you don't talk to Andreas now, my own, my own he's gonna he's gonna ask for a book. Now, I, I must have, I won't have if you don't it. ask, I mean, if you don't talk to him now, it. there's gonna Long be a part coming it. up where uh, it, the the uh, stigma will not be there for us. 
All right, we should be able to upgrade. Get seven. Our holy work continues. Go ahead and upgrade. Fellow sanctified vessel. May Aureus's divine radiance flow through me and into you. Really upset about losing all of that. 23,000 vigor. But, I mean, it happened, you know, I mean, I didn't... Didn't follow my own code. Alright, in here, you'll have the, uh... The crow now. Can look at that. Got a bunch of stuff popping off now. Talk to him. If you want, need anything, you need to purchase anything. So let's see. Pay, pay her, talk to Andreas, upgrade heals, talk to Holy Man, Umbral, upgrade stuff if you can. I don't have any vigor, so I'm not going to be able to, but it'd be a good idea. If you could upgrade your gear, go ahead. And from here, we're going to warp out of here to Upper Corner. I'm going to start this process. All right, out for the map. It's going to be over here to the left. It's going to be a fire witch coming up. Ignore her for now. Go ahead and buff. And we'll deal with her in a second. It's going to be a bunch of, like, fire thrall and stuff that kind of pop up here. You want to deal with those guys first. All right, enter Umbral. Got her. Cook her. Grab this loot. She sometimes drops loot. She didn't. Pop this up here. It's gonna unlock the gate underneath us. See that? Don't just jump down there yet. I'm gonna come back over here, jump across, and not miss. I miss it every time. Jump across. <laughs> Third time the charm. There we go. Jump across, jump across, onto the hand. Need to slow down. I'm trying to rush because I want to get a, a lot done in this thing. That's just costing me more time. Jump across. Grab the loot. Now we can roll back off to the gate. Through the gate. Exit umbral. Ah, there's enemies. Next it umbral. What's nearby? There we go. All right. In this room, we got a ruiner and some dogs. Line the dogs up, kind of, kind of get them going here. Give them some, some love. Fry them. Pull the ruiner close. Fry him. You gotta wait for your stamina. Go ahead and back up. Fry him. One more time. You can burn through that all at one time with the dogs in him. Sometimes. Grab this loot over here to the left of where they entered the arena. And that's it here. Forward. Through this. This is so we came in across the way there. Oh let's let's go that. I see a loot over there. Let's check this out. 
knew about the loot to the left. There's loot here too. Grab that. So we entered through that, do that door, that opening over here. We're gonna go to this one. There's gonna be two stigmas, a fairy, and some thrall. Let's go ahead and enter Umbral. Pop the stigma. Take out the fairy if you can. Uh, I'll use one. Rises and falls with me. And if you think I'll allow you to pass Seven hills is nice. Then you're even more She's done. It's your last chance. How is he up there? If you know what's good for you. Free me. Now. Man, I was really looking forward to some upgrades. Grab this loot. Start this one. That's going to roll while that's going off. Jump down here. Grab this bridge. Pull it over. The platform. That one's finished. Come up this ladder. And grab this chest again. All right, let's roll back out. There's gonna be some fire thrall down here as well. Some of them like, you know, commit suicide. I'll try to kill you. Pop this stigma while we're in Umbral. Let's knock that one out. Come back down for all this loot in a second. It's all yours. Take it, and I can get you more, a lot more. Just please, don't. Back to this ladder. We're gonna go up. We're gonna go to another beacon. There's gonna be a fire witch and a dog. Two explosive thrall, explosive thrall first. So we're gonna take those thrall out, exit umbral, and then deal with the witch and the dog. So right around the corner here, they're gonna pop up. They're gonna commit suicide. Suicide bombers. Let them do their thing, exit umbral. Dog and the witch. Get ready for them. She's out in the distance over there. You can see the dog. I wouldn't worry about the dog just yet. Try to focus on the witch first and take her out. Whoa, what is that? <laughs> it's all good. Dang, she, she hurts. Definitely need to upgrade some stuff if we can. That's what that, you know, 23 was for. No worries, I'll just be cautious of that. Everything in here is gonna hurt. Until I can buff up a little. So to the beacon. I'm doing nothing. I'd like the third ending. If I can, if I can figure out the third ending, that'd be awesome. I already have the other two done. Um, in a little bit, we're gonna move an NPC here. Keep that in mind, we'll come back here for that. So we're gonna head back down. We popped all three stigmas here. The two here and the third one down here. Don't worry about ex ex exiting Umbral here if you're back in Umbral. We're gonna plant a seed right in front of us. Plant your seed, highly suggested. this loot and stuff before I rest so I don't have to worry about all these fire guys again all right rest how are we doing 37 minutes uh... I think we can do it it's gonna be It'll be fun. So loot up here on the stairs. Ahead of us here, there's gonna be a reaper across the way. We're gonna take out the reaper. There's a rogar, a fire rogar to the left here. Take out the reaper. The, 
I'm sorry, an archer, not a reaper. There's a reaper over here. There's an archer there. He's here. I'm gonna try to sabotage us getting that loot. Take him out. Now you can grab the loot. There's a a gargoyle in here, so quickly through. Another Rogar here. That stuff in the middle glowing is bombs on the floor. So that's why you don't want to just cut right through there and you'll get blown up. There's another stigma here. I'm gonna pop that. Don't worry about talking to him for now. Get ready for that gargoyle. And the Reaper. Oh, you know what? I forgot a door, too. There's the Reaper. Let's see if I can pop this, get it, and go get out of here. I want to go get the door. I forgot more so than fight the Reaper. Alright. Through, through. Get this door. Yeah, you, you can't get me that, buddy. That goes back to the big arena that we just fought everything in. Just kind of connecting everything because we're going to have to come back through here later on. I'm going to go ahead and rest. Just to clear everything out. And do this part again. Alright, buff. Get this guy. Through here, quickly. Oh, where did he go? I didn't talk to him. He moved already. But they didn't mess anything up. There's a dog and a fire witch outside of here. She's got a parasite. So we can uh, take it out from here usually. I'll show you that. Instead of trying to like fight her and deal with all of that, try to pop it here. Careful, bro. Oh, he came in. Careful with that. She's right there, maybe. This works. Where are you? Got it. So, good to go. Take her out. She's right there. She's usually back a little bit. That's why I was back trying to pop it. He's done. Drop down, grab some loot. Back down again where the archer is and around. I didn't talk to him. You, that's a quick talk with him anyway, but I hope we didn't miss anything up. Okay, here's an exit for Umbral. We don't need it yet. We're gonna use it in a second. Enter Umbral here. We're just gonna go over here and grab some more loot. That's all we're doing. Sometimes there's a fairy, sometimes there's not. On the return. Weird. Pop this door. Gonna run in here. Don't worry about the thrall. Just take out the mage in the back. Because she's not throwing anything at you when you go down. Down the stairs. Uh, there's gargoyles down here. There's, there they are. I don't know where they're at. I couldn't find like. I should look harder, but you can. I think there's three of them. Pop the belly for loot. I'm gonna look while we're here because we're doing well on Umbral. 
Sometimes I they do all this in one run with the umbrella from the other thing. Know who I am. So if I tell Pop in the door and all that. Or we may Pop these platforms and pull them out so we can get the other loot. You understand the consequences should you choose otherwise. Let me see if I can find them. Now, I know who you are as well, and I know you're a man experienced in acquiring items of an illicit nature. A practice I'm willing to overlook. Should you oh, he's already on the ground. For me? Tell me, what did you know of your artifacts? Grab this. Grab that. Back up the stairs. Platforms. Roll across, grab the loot. Back down. Almost done with all this stuff. Tying everything together. Back to door, pop door. This may or may not have a fairy. And exit on roll. All right, ahead of us, a couple of dogs and a rogue and a uh, rogar. Come on, dog. Some loot here. Saving my uh, my mana. There's gonna be a skin stiller here. Go ahead and take him out. And then we're gonna pick up some loot. Enter Umbral, grab some more loot, and then head for a long run. <laughs> loot there hiding, loot here in the tree. And pop Umbral. Pop this. And coming up is the stigma. Oh, he's there. This was it. And damn, I was tonight. Though. Talk to him. What could or prevent? It's always the same. Ten minutes, my own damn. Even when I, even when I tried. All right, cool. Loot here. I think that fixed the other conversation. Gotta go up this ladder. Wrap this around, no seed there, no need. We're back at base, basically, on the back side. Loot down here, now that stigma, if you didn't talk to Andreas when we were back at base earlier, it will not be there. You'll have to go and talk to him, and uh, let's open this door. He'll tell you that he needs the book, you'll come back here, get the book. All right. Pushing forward. No worries about all this stuff. You could use... No, because if you use a moth here, it's going to take you back to the seed. So don't do that. You're going to have to run this. Run this to base. Doing good. Down to Andreas. We're going to talk to him. Hand him his book. And almost completes his side quest. And we fight him later. He's gonna try to get us. Ha! Then, mm. well, you. In fact, I'd be glad. It's the least. Having a debt is no small. Having a debt is no small. Having a debt is no small All right. privilege, friend. Let's rest. All right. Now we're going to do something like the weirdest part, I, I think, in the game. Let's go to the district. We can fit this in real quick. I think we have time. I mean, it's running 47 minutes, but it's cool. It's going to be less than that. I'm going to edit some stuff out. Make it a little bit smaller, cleaner. Oh, what am I doing? So go here. You can see her over there. But she wants us to wear some silly clothes. So 
So throw on the noble woman. All of her stuff, we just picked it up. Throw that on. And then go talk to her. This is going to force her to move to Except where I showed you earlier. Ah, my invitation reached you. So that's it. Kindness, perhaps, Back. Throw on your gear if you want. I only suggest it. Uh, should be fine. I don't know if I want that one or this one. Definitely that one. Throw that on for now. Let's go. Does that look right? Yeah. Now we're going to warp back to our seed. I'm going to show you where she is now. We'll talk to her. There's uh, some upgrades that you can purchase from her from an Inferno build standpoint. So out here, those Thrall are going to show up. One's going to explode himself. Let him do his thing, take out the rest of the will. If you just want to like kind of run through and hit Umbral and go up the ladder, you can do that as well. So back to that Umbral ladder that we've used a few times now. Gonna roll off to the stairs here. Around, now the ferry and all of that's gonna be back. So keep that in mind. Poppers. All right. Exit humble. Dog and witch. Talk to NBC. Oh, she's dead. That's how that's supposed to go. Alright, dog over here. Alright, and now NPC. No, and she just she moved. You have here. Went through her dialogue. Ah, and my here invitation you go. reached you. If you're an inferno build, this is awesome. This is awesome. And the and these dogs are awesome. All right, so inventory. Best is mom. Or run back to the seed, it's up to you. And I'm gonna work back to base. And that's it. That is part 17 of the walkthrough. Thanks for being here. I thank you for your support. I hope all this is helping. We'll see you in the next one and take care.